Hey everyone, welcome back to Film Zone. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to the channel and leave a like on the video. A man with an ear cyst spurted out a thick white substance. In the video, Lee cut open a man's earlobe area where he had a cyst. At first, blood came out of the hole, then it flowed a clear liquid. They pushed uncompressed cysts, more freeing more blood and white thickening material. That was like the keratin. Although Lee didn't specify, it didn't seem. Like the six could hold that much liquid, and fans were horrified to see how much came out of the small area. Wow, wasn't expecting to be that good. One person stated another called the cyst a gift that keeps on giving because the thick white liquid seemed never ending. Nose Blackhead Extractions Probably the most relatable video of the bunch this clip shows Dr. Lee going to town on a teenager's blackhead covered nose. She uses a sharp lube comb on extractor to puncture and compress the tiny black pores until they released white stringy pus. Wait, you've never seen it? No, you've it. never seen what it looks like? Yes, I can see it. Oh. Nose blackhead extractions. Lee cut four golf ball sized blackhead gross off a woman's ear. During Lee's initial meeting with Jennifer Lee, diagnosed the masses as keloids, a type of raised scar tissue that forms due to trauma to the area. According to the American Academy of Dermatology, these inflated scars can grow to be much bigger than the wound that caused the scar in the first place. They revealed that it was Jennifer's infected pierced ears that created the keloids to develop, though Lee said they were probably the biggest she'd ever seen. To handle Jennifer, Lee had to surgically extract the keloids. First, she applied a local anesthetic on Jennifer's ears, then she deliberately cut the gross off, attempting to avoid as much of her actual ear tissue as possible. Dilated Pour of Winer, Giant Blackhead During last year's Fall Pops of Christmas holiday special, Dr. Lee cured a 55-year-old patient whose black hair transformed into an enlarged pour of Winer, aka a blackhead that got so big that its surface hardened and stretched out the pore. In case you missed that fabulous deep-rooted extraction, this is three minutes of a satisfying surgery. Like Upper lip blackhead extraction. Typically we find annoying blackheads popping up on areas of the face where there's notably oil secretion like the nose and chin. But this video shows a much major exhibition of blackheads across a patient's upper lip, a place where they're able to grow and decay undetected for a long time. This clip shows Dr. Lee taking to the deep-rooted growth. Black Blackhead Extraction The thumbnail alone will tell you that this video is much gnarly the mind of blackheads concealing this man's back is just a tip of the problem. The extraction is more of a digging and scratching process than a pop, but fascinating nevertheless. Orange Sized Blackhead Blump on the Back of Her Thighs Dr. Pimple Popper also removed an orange sized lump that was originating on the back of a woman's thigh for 10 years. After considering the lump, Lee diagnosed it as lymphoma, a fat field growth that remains in the place between a person's muscle and skin, according to the Mayo Clinic. While it's unclear what makes lymphomas, it's likely at least partly genetic. Fortunately, the lumps are not cancerous and usually harmless, the Mayo Clinic says. To treat the lymphoma, Lee first treated the area with local anesthetic, then penetrated the lymphoma with a sharp surgical tool. Instantly, the lump made a spurting and squeaking sound, and a white liquid and blood began to ooze out of it. Ear Blackhead Extractions Like blackheads of the nasal variety, those tiny black dots speckling the inner ear are pretty common. The results in this case are also fairly routine, white flabbery stuff blowing from the pore, but you must have a stomach of iron to watch you until the end. I'm sure that pore is exposed. It looks like it is pretty much, though. Lee removing a massive nose growth that prevented a man from breathing. Lee worked with a variety of patients during Season 3, including a man with nose growth so big they stopped him from breathing, a teen with a brownish rash that caused him to be teased at school, and a woman with ear cysts that gave her horrible headaches. One Blackhead and Whitehead Extractions A patient is a 90-year-old man with a case named rhinophema, a condition which was featured on Dr. Pimple Popper's last season. Rhinophema creates thickening of the skin on the nose, improved oil production in the area, and very large pores loaded with keratinous material. The result is a bulbous minefield of blackheads and whiteheads, all of which Dr. Lee pinches up and out. And he has these little blackheads. That's all the time we have for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We will see y'all next time.